Ah. It's so funny when I hear the phrase, no thoughts, head empty. It's because, like, lol, can't relate. Mostly because of my ADHD. I have literally never known a moment of peace. My thoughts are always whirling by, and I have a constant monologue in my head or dialogue if I'm daydreaming. There's always something for me to think about. Sometimes it can be tiring, but in a way, it's nice. My thoughts keep me company. Too many thoughts. Head full. So I was applying for Australian citizenship, and the interviewer asked, do you have a criminal record? And I said, no, is that still required? Oh. My God. Jeff, I swear. I want to write something so good, people stay up till three in the morning writing theories and headcanons about it. Argent, I'm sorry. Pucky, a notification for your post woke me up at night. I never turned on notifications for you. Yeah, don't worry, I did that for you. Okay, but give me one good reason why you wouldn't date Kermit the Frog, besides that he is a puppet and a frog. I can't beat Miss Piggy in a fight. She's very strong and does karate. You know what? It's a very good point. <laughs> Archery's just dabbing before you murder somebody. I... Did... Okay! I'm so mad some crypto mining warehouse got doxxed and it's only like four hour drive away. If I only had a car... Pilgrimage. I'm talking about criminal activity. Ah! Crusade! What am I smiling at? <laughs> the made-up scenarios, of course. <laughs> Self-love is imagining how lovely life will be when I'm in my little cottage on a great big plot of land with gardens upon gardens, fresh bread in the oven, pie on the windowsill, and a cat pressing its sweet little head against my legs as we go about our day. Stop having amazing dreams, please. It's killing me. I want it. If I ever respond to you with just a heart emoji, it's not meant to be dismissive. I'm bumping my shoulder against yours because I like you. I'm blinking slowly at you like a cat. I'm not actually mad. I just like the comedic delivery of righteous but pointless anger. Y you guys get me, right? Must suck ass to be like a lawyer or something in Pokemon World. They haven't made any cool lawyer Pokemon yet. Uh, hello. I think we have a different definition of lawyers, but sure. Well, why wouldn't ho oh be a lawyer? They're a phoenix, right? In the kindest way possible. Fuck you. By the way, I think Anon Ass should have a return to sender option where you can reply privately with your own message and the person who sent the Anon can publish it, but only if they're willing to admit they sent you the Anon. <sighs> Tumblr 1v1 cage match, let's go! I love how Tumblr is reverse chronological order, so when your mutual starts having a Blorbo breakdown overnight, you get to start with the insane conclusion and work your way back to where they first went off the rails. It's great! It is human nature to weave strings of yarn, threads, or fibers together to make a cloth, a textile. Humans will see a soft cellulose plant material or downy animal coat and say, Hey, is anyone gonna twist that? Staple fiber in order to make a cohesive thread and then not wait for an answer. Me is learning macrame. The paleolithic archaic human that lives on my brainstem. Oh, yes! Fuck! Yes! That's it! That's it, baby! Shit! Yes! Yeah! Starline wishes he had what Agent Stone has. Dr. Eggman's phone number. NASA, in your orbit. Well, I fucking hope so. Self-care is breaking into NASA and launching yourself directly into the fucking void. May we suggest a soothing bath instead? I agree with NASA here. Please don't. What the fuck is Morbius even about? Morbius. 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 Morbid time. This is why we're getting a sequel, guys. You guys don't understand. The algorithm does not give a shit that you guys are talking about the show sarcastically. The only cares that just you're saying Morbius or Morbid Time. It's gonna give you a. It's giving you a second one. What have you done? I always giggle at job titles given to certain employees. Like when I used to work at KFC Taco Bell restaurant, my job was to cook the KFC side of things. But my official title was on paper, Chicken Champion. I'm so blind. I kept reading titles as titties. <sighs> Finally. Safe for work titties. Isn't that your thing though, Pam? Listen here, you little shit!